basically what happened, we were dispatched today at about 1.40 p.m. Uh, to a disturbance here. There was a family disturbance at the home here. It's the uh, 13,000 block of Hoffman Court, Grand Haven Township. Um, initial information was that there was an argument inside the home. Um, we learned that a 40-year-old uh, female subject had armed herself with a firearm and had fired shots inside the residence. There was initially two family members that were in the home with her, uh, and they later uh, left the home. They're now out safely. They are uninjured at this time. Um, and at this point, uh, the female remains inside there, we believe, armed with a firearm. Uh, so we're asking neighbors and the public to avoid this area if they can at this time, and uh, uh, that's uh, the update that we have right now at this point. What, what have uh, the family members, what kind of gun did they say that this person had? Uh, we're, we're still looking into all that information. It's still coming in as we speak, but uh, it's a, a long gun style um, gun. I don't have any more details than that right now. So. Someone had mentioned a neighbor had said that it was at a clubhouse. Was that at a clubhouse or was that a house house? No, this is a residence, okay. yeah. We uh, saw in the release that neighbors in the area are being asked to shelter in their basement. Additionally, some of the schools have been alerted that this is happening. Right. How, what's the threat to the public at this point? Well, right now, the only threat is located inside the residence, and, and so that's fine. We have multiple units on scene. Our critical response team is here on scene making sure that um, the neighborhood is safe. Um, we just grow concerned when there is shots fired that any of those can unintentionally go outside of the home as well. Um, and so we ask the, the neighbors to stay in the basement if they can, stay sheltered inside their home if they need to be home. They could also leave the area. Um, and other people not to, not to come in the area here. What kind of contact have you had with the woman? Uh, we're still working on that as we speak. We have crisis negotiators on scene, um, and they're working to make contact right now. So we have no contact so far yet? Did I, my latest update, we have not had contact, so we're still working on that. Anything else? Does this have anything to do with the courthouse situation earlier? I was assuming no. not, but just wanted to make sure. Yeah, good question. I knew that would come up. This is completely unrelated. Uh, this appears to be a domestic type situation um, and, and nothing to do with uh, any other threats, the, the situation, the courthouse or anything like that. So. Did she fire at the police at all? Or no? Uh, no, I, the, the shot were fired, was fired before uh, police arrived on scene. And the family members, what kind of relations are they, like a brother, sister? Uh, I believe they're her parents. Um, the female's parents are the, the family members who were initially in the home. Do they all live together? Or? Everybody, yes, who's involved lives at that residence. Have you ever had any calls to this house before in the past? I don't have that information in front of me right now. Do they uh, have any idea, the family members, do the family members have any idea why or what's going on or what's going through their mind at this time? Yeah, we're still working to learn all that right now. So. Still very early in the investigation. Um, initial responders' uh, job is just to make sure that people are out of there safely, and now our job is working to make sure that uh, the female leaves the home safely as well. So.